What is popping, guys? It's your boy, Video Game Ninja today, bringing you guys a brand new unboxing video of a brand new G Fuel flavor that came out like two days ago. But I actually got something else. I actually ordered a pair. Of, a pair. I actually ordered the cans also this time. As you guys know, I didn't do the Phaseberry versus the Phaseberry can. And holy shit, this is a fucking heavy ass box, as you guys can't tell. But I was. That's why I ordered them, but they were also not bad, but, I mean, if you guys watched my review of me unboxing the, not unboxing, but try, uh, trying the three flavors, you're wondering what happened to the last one, which is the Phaseberry. Honestly, guys, that one is in my dad's tummy now, and never to be seen again, so I had to order them again. As you guys can see, so this is how they come, so, it's, it comes really protected, it comes with this, it comes with my order form with a brand new sticker that we have i haven't i don't have yet or haven't seen yet i should say um cans in here? No, just, so it's 12 cans oh i thought it was gonna be like a big package it's not it's just it's just multiple if i can get this out in multiple of these so it's three of these packages and each of them i'm guessing brings the four four flavors you guys can see each of them brings the four flavors which is the blue ice the phase berry the rainbow sherbet and the sour cherry nothing really too spectacular in here so i will have the review on the phase berry this is the phase the phase berry can coming out sometime so we have the thing you're all you're all here for the brand new g fuel flavor now if you're wondering it's not the pewdiepie one it's not the brand new because that's not brand new i'm talking about shit. i'm talking about dub melon meant inspired by tsm daquan so as you guys can see the dub the w for all the wins that i'd be taking around these towns she feel at the back it's a pretty cool collector's box if you guys ask me i like this collector's box it's pretty fire it has a watermelon look this thing just fell on top of me also it comes with the same sticker the the blue eye sticker i would say so as you guys can see the let me open it up real quick. Comes with a green to go scooper. I thought it'll be, it should be a little darker green in my opinion. I have a green, I think. Yeah, I have a green, same color green. Here's the the shaker cup that comes with the flavor. This looked more red to me when I saw it on the app. Now that I get it, it's actually kind of a fire shaker cup. W, like I said, all the W's I'd be taking. And the inside is a green inside, as you guys can see the green pouch splitter green now let's take you guys to the tub oh it also comes with a watermelon sticker pretty cool sticker pretty cool g fuel sticker oh three stickers in one day it's a new world record for me the tub guys the dub melon mint tub nice looking tub if you ask me nice tub overall here's a nutrient facts for some of y'all if you're all oh, it's upside down my bad here's a nutrient facts for some of y'all if you guys are into that anyways so nice tub. I'm excited for this flavor because if you guys know, I ran out of watermelon. It was the first flavor I ever ran out of and I never got it again because I felt it was not watermelon enough. Now this one has a taste of mint with watermelon. So that means as I'm drinking, I'm probably going to get the hint of mint as it's going down my, my, my esophagus. So let's hope for the best. So I'm going to go get some water and ice and we're going to try this bad boy. So I got my water and ice, guys, and I'm ready to open the tub. So now, overall, this this is a this is a flavor I'm relatively excited from. I think the last flavor I did was snow cone, and snow cone was pretty good. It's a blue Gatorade flavor. It's not snow cone; it's blue Gatorade flavor. So that's pretty fire. Anyways, here you guys have me opening the tub. Oh, what the hell? That's like sunk in. Boom! Dub melon mint is open. Let me give you the smell test of the powder. <laughs> Huh, it just has the same smell as normal watermelon would have. It's just like, you know, normal watermelon. I don't know if you, get, if you guys have had watermelon. It's a fire flavor, by the way, but that's the smell it has. Anyways, I got to go look for this fucking scooper. BRB. Right, so here we go. I have the one scoop of dumbbell and mint ready to go in the shaker cup. Look at that, guys. Look at that new flavor. It's always a, it's always a boner, bro. 
Boz. I'm not, I don't get that. It's a joke. Now I'm gonna go shake this for 47 minutes. Be right back. And I'm done shaking for this for 47 minutes. If you guys, so I know somebody told me in my last video, um, can you show us the color of like how the, what this looks like, which they saw, but they want me to show you the color when I get like a dark sugar cup. So I'm gonna pour it into a cup real quick for y'all and give you the color look. Like, there you go. So the color of this guys is, as you guys can see, it's a pinkish, a pink um, watermelon look. If, it looks kind of, it's the color of um, pink lemonade. That's the same color as pink lemonade. Anyways, enough of that. Let's get down to what y'all came for. The taste test. Is this worth your fucking $40 or $35 if you don't get the collector's box? Let's smell it first, Bill. Okay. First off, straight watermelon smell. Just smells like the original watermelon. I don't smell no mint. Yep, straight watermelon. So, let's taste it. Guys, this is mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's fucking fire. It's exactly what I was wishing for. A watermelon flavor. More watermelon tasting the original watermelon. But as, as as it's dancing in your mouth, and it's going down your esophagus, you taste the mint. It's like a, it's just like a little hint. It's not too strong or too weak. But you, you definitely taste the mint as soon as it's going down. As soon as it's about to fuck you. But the watermelon, huge improvement to the old watermelon. You really taste the watermelon this time. But it's not it's not like that like fake watermelon. You know? It's like that real real freshly squeezed watermelon you just got straight out the corner store. And you said, fuck it, I'm eating this right now. That's exactly what this watermelon reminds me of. It's fucking fire. I definitely like this flavor. This is, once again, another GG for G Fuel. Another amazing flavor they decided to make. And I'm I'm fucking happy because, you know, it's $40. And the flavor stinks. Like, the uh, a couple of the few ones, you're fucking, you, you want to shoot yourself. Pause. Overall, though, guys, it is an amazing flavor. This is definitely a solid motherfucking eight. Sorry for the for the F word, but it's an eight. It's amazing. It's a watermelon. Who doesn't like watermelon in this day and in this day and age? Go we'll get the dumb melon mint inspired by TSM Daquan. Guys. Vanessa's flavor. It's fucking good. It's fire. It's watermelon mint. Anyways, guys. That was it from your boy video game user today today, bringing you guys a brand new G Fuel video unboxing. Basically, you guys gotta and uh, be on the lookout for the um, the phase barrier versus the phase barrier can to see can versus tub again. You guys enjoyed those videos. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Remember to leave a like and subscribe. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe, please. Thank you. Anyways, see ya.